Welcome Teletubby fans to another unofficial episode. Oh, the camera is in portrait. Sorry guys. Anyways, Teletubbies decided to move Belly Chubby Prison to another place. Somewhere far away so they wouldn't have to deal with annoying midnight screeching. Yikes. I can't deal with this anymore. To be specific, they moved the Belly Chubby prison near the theater where Walton had a show. Oh no, oh. it looks like Belly Chubbies are attempting to escape. Hey dinner, look up. Yes, it's a stop sign, which means you have to stay inside until Tinky Winky gives you a permission to leave the prison. You want to get treats, don't you? Good thinking. What are you shrugging? You know the rules. Anyways, Teletubbies are on their way to bring some treats for Belly Chubbies for good behavior. Hello Walton. It seems like you're free right now. Wanna go with us to Belly Chubbies? Yeah. Hum. No. I still have lots of stuff to do. Okay. If you go to the right here, you can get some nice loot in this secret room. Oh, thanks. Belly Chubbies, I grant the permission to come out. There you go guys, split everything equally. Oh my god. I can't watch it. I bit a fat stack on Normie. Dipsy. What? Lesson number two of this episode. Don't make bets on hungry hungry belly chubbies. Teletubbies spent an entire day trying to make up chelly bunnies. I mean belly chubbies. And now they are heading home. Alright guys. It was a rough day. Let's go watch something. And then go sleep. What the heck? We're definitely going to miss an episode of Despacito 2. Oh, anyways. No. It doesn't make sense. The tubby turbine is still spinning around. Let's check it out. Oh, that's interesting. The redstone wire is missing here. I wonder who could break it. Maybe Nunu. -Nu. Yeah. Definitely Nunu. -Nu. No, it wasn't me. Then what are you doing here? You know, taking a relaxing walk. Oh, really? Okay, I lied. I don't have legs indeed, instead, I have wheels so I'm taking a relaxing midnight ride. Are you happy? Then who broke the wire? Yeah. yeah. This guy. Who is the heck are you? And why did you cause an electricity shortage? I'm basically you, but evil. I'm here to fight Teletubbies, on behalf Holy of- Holy shoe, you were like Tinky, but less lame, haha. -ha. Do you like video games? 
What a nonsense to say, Poe. He must too. He's like all a dinky winky no, after all. guys, I'm a villain. Like a bad guy, I have doom in. Cool. You know, you play together since you are a the version of Dinky Winky, you should have the same. Looks like somebody's taking your bed, Master. Who is that handsome fellow that looks exactly like you? Dinky Winky, this is... Wait, what our belly chubbies are doing here? Um, um, they asked me to take them for a midnight walk. I hope you don't mind. You what? I just want to know What's the matter, buddy? They're probably gonna kick me out. Because Tank is so cool. I wish I could be such a tank like Tinky Tank. I understand your concern here, but since I'm a cool narrator, I can't relate. But, if I were on your place, I would suit up and would kick Tank's bottom so hard he won't return. Yeah, show him who's the boss. You're right. Thanks, Mark Horse. You're welcome. Haha. -ha. Here is your package. Thanks. Come out. Thanky tank. You pussy. I'm gonna kick your bottom. Oh look. Lame Dinky Tank has returned. Wait. Where is Tank? He ran away. Because we were bugging him so much. He couldn't handle it anymore. I suppose you can. Holy shit. Guys look at this. Tinky is so cool. OMG. Where did you get four guns and two swords? I knew the master will come back. Oh. I came back to kick Tank's bottom. But it seems like there's no need to do that anymore. That, that is so, so cool. cool. Well, well, welcome back. back. And that's how this story ends. Tinky Winky also built a water slide nearby, after returning as a gift to ensure his dominance. That was kind of random, but whatever. See you in the next episode.